you're going to roll down inch by inch, vertebrae by vertebrae, as though you are holding an orange or an apple here that keeps your neck and spine in proper alignment. And you're going to roll down very slowly using your abdominal muscles. A little bit of the hip flexors too. Roll all the way down. Okay, well, let's concentrate on the lower abdominals. What I'd like you to do is I'd like you to draw one knee in, then the other, and then I'd like you to take them out and then bring them in. Take them out and bring them in. The further you take them out, the more potential strain you are placing on the lower back. So if you have lower back problems, I would rather you do the less intense level up above there. See what they're doing? They don't lengthen the lever, the lever being the legs. Okay, in. In. This is a tough one, isn't it? Yes, it's also a very good one because it works all areas of the tummy except the obliques, the side of the abdominals. Okay, up. There you go. Okay, we'll do five more. You can do these now. Come on, five. Don't think about them. Four. Think about something else. Just three left. Three, don't give up, please. No, 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 not allowed. Two, one left. Less intense people, of course, only do half. There you go, okay. Place your feet flat on the floor, lower abdominal work. Hands beneath your bottom, draw one knee in, then the other. Now press your feet up. What you're going to do is you're going to press up. That may cause the legs to move slightly. It's a contraction of the lower abdominals and a hold, okay? So contract and hold, good for you. Place your hands here, you'll feel it working. Contract and hold. Close your eyes if it helps you to feel those muscle contractions. Okay, and press up with the legs and down. And press and down. You did well today. Okay, good for you. And listen, if you'd rather not do tummy today, you'd like to do inner outer thigh or any other body part, you go ahead and do it. That's fine. And please, you don't feel that you have to work during the, through the commercial breaks because you don't have to. It's an option. Okay, squeeze. And now going into the commercial break in a few seconds, what I want you to do is we're going to do one exercise for the obliques. We'll be at one level. Ah, uh, we've got a little while before then though. Okay, let's do five more of these. Five and four. Hold the contraction. Three, hold it. Good for you, two and one. If ever you want to raise to really focus on those other areas, raise your head. Now in this position here, let's come up. Contract and hold. Just hold it there. And then release and lower slowly. Once more, contract and hold. Okay. One more, contract and hold. Lower. Contract and hold. Okay, last one, and then we're going to work at one level. I'm going to show you an exercise on my knees. Okay, come on up. Here's your exercise. What I'd like you to do is in this position here, place your hand right here, okay? Then I want you to bend over to the side here and then pull up. And that's going to work the obliques. Very slowly, very controlled, and come on up. There you go, you feel that? Place your fingers just like this on the side, up. And over, and up. Try to do 15 each side, that's approximately four. Okay, each side, and then I'll see you back for your cool down. Good job.